Yo. Uh, all right. <clears throat> Let's talk about the quest uh, by Golly Get Jolly. Um, for some people, it might be uh, confusing. For some people, not. I'm going to explain it. I'm going to break it down. And I have something stuck in between my teeth. I'm trying to get it out. All right. Mm -hmm. Almost. All right. Got it. <laughs> um, let's start. Let's start. Let's start. So the very first thing is for the people who don't know, share ten jelly bean tokens. Um, it's actually quite simple. Uh, you need some jelly beans, which are right over here. Uh, you can look them up on Google. You know, there's some uh, wikis on Bee Swarm Simulator where you can actually find out on where to get them. You can get them from quests. Uh, you can basically get them in so many places. So I always have a full stack of jelly beans. I don't know why. I don't even use them very much, but uh, probably that's the reason why. But what you have to do is you need a mate or you go onto an official server. You go onto uh, a place and you just spawn... Uh, these uh, jelly beans and as soon as somebody else actually picks them up uh, it's gonna fill up and it's actually quite easy because you drop like 11 to 12 jelly beans something along those lines so if somebody's actually gonna uh, pick them up for you you're going to immediately get them uh, get the quest done now the next thing is match 10 pairs and memory match games uh, there are so many different memory matches I'm just gonna go here into the one on uh, Peppa Patch. You can again uh, look them up on the internet. It's actually quite simple. There are so many different pa uh, memory matches. Some you can actually only play at night, which is quite uh, sad. So there, there's one. There's one at the new place. So let me actually uh, quickly go over there real fast. And there's one down here, for example. Uh, you know, there's some videos on YouTube on checking out on where every single spot is on how to get these memory matches done. All you have to do is get the right pairs. It's not that hard. You can do it. I believe in you. And let's get to the third one. So the third one is going to be collect one million red pollen. Now, I'm not really sure if that number is going to be one million for everyone or if it's just, you know, if it's based. I don't know. Did you have that? Do you remember? It wasn't one million. Okay, so it might be uh, the same for everyone. So one million red pollen. Um, I suggest a uh, mixed hive. Uh, that's what we're doing until you have every quest line done. Um, because then you will reach the end game. Now, I only have to get spirit bear done. And then I will be going into, uh, yeah, that, into the end game. So, uh... Mixed Hive is actually the best way on doing it. Uh, for me, uh, Pepper Patch is a really, really good patch to do. If you are not that far in uh, the game to Pepper Patch, you can actually go um, over here to uh, Rose, Rosefield. And Rosefield is actually really good as well. So Rosefield is going to cut it. Uh, it has a lot of red uh, flowers on it and stuff. Yeah, so that's pretty good. Now, another one, it's going to be a bit more on the difficult side. Sometimes, sometimes not, uh, which is the pineapple patch. Um, it's a very white uh, flower field, a very white flower field. So it might actually take you some longer. It depends on what kind of hive you have. You know, like I said, I have a mixed one. I have... Um, you know, some white percent, some blue percent, some red percent, so everything's in it. So now the next one is the haste token ones. I don't have any hasty bees that give me haste tokens. I have some other bees and it took me quite some time to get it. But if you actually have some haste uh, bees in your hive, you should uh, worry not at all to get those haste tokens uh, done. And yeah, next one, collect 10 ticket tokens. Uh, you know, that kind of explains it itself. You can drop down... Um, Let's say some beads. Uh, you can kill some bosses like coconut crab. You can do a uh, spider. You can do the werewolf. You can do mantis. Sometimes if you're really lucky, I think uh, the ladybugs can give them to you as well. But uh, yeah, so boss farming should be the best uh, way for you. Or maybe even just summon a honey storm. Let me show you how to do that real quick. If you summon a honey storm... Uh, you can actually collect a lot of tickets on the field. It helps out a lot as well. So, which is right over here. You can summon a honey storm right there. So that's not a problem either. Now collect 1,000 honey tokens. Um, so if you have something called coin scatter or do a uh, boss uh, farming like I'm doing right now, you can see you have some honey tokens here. Um, I also have coin scatter, which is going to be a passive that I don't know where I got it from. I think I have it from the belt or the pedal one. No, is it the pedal one? I don't know. I don't think so. I think you get coin scatter quite early on. But uh, yeah, anyways, uh, as soon as you have coin scatter, um, it's going to shoot out all of your coins that you have in your pollen. You can pick them up. It's very nice. It's very good. Um, but you don't need that. You can you can farm bosses. Like, let's go to the ladybugs over here. 
you know. And again, Honeystorm uh, also is going to help you out tons with this. So ask a friend to host a Honeystorm or do it yourself, whatever. Uh, it shouldn't take you too long. Now, collect one hour of motivating nectar. Now I need my girlfriend to help me find how did I uh, did motivating nectar. I think that was the roast field. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was the roast field. Yeah, she nods. So it is the roast field. Now, what I did here was uh, pretty simple. I bought myself. I, I did tons of tutorials already. Uh, go on uh, them and check them out uh, where I buy uh, the canister, the, the, the planter. Sorry, the, pa uh, the planter. Where is my planter? I keep losing my planter. I don't know where it is. Like, I, where did I place it again? Did I place it somewhere? Like, it's not in my inventory. Every time it's not in my inventory, I put my planter somewhere. I have no idea where I put it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it's on Pine Tree, everybody. Oh, hello. So let's take that. Oh, look at that. The planter actually gave me one as well. Uh, you can buy the planter in the blue HQ. Uh, it's not too expensive. And you're going to go into Rosefield. And you're going to drop that planter down. Boom, like this. And it's gonna farm uh, the, the 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 good old what 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 was it motivating nectar. Um, you can stay on the field. You can go AFK and collect it after 20 minutes, and it's definitely going to finish your quest like it did with me. Uh, the next one is going to be admire black bear's honey wreath. I think it's called wreath wrath wreath. I don't know wreath. I think it's wreath, um, which is right over here. Uh, it's very important that you have a full set of pollen. You know, have it all uh, farmed out, and then you're gonna admire it. Then it's gonna turn it, uh, turn all the pollen into honey, and you can collect it right over here. And now open four gift boxes around the map, which are these ones right here. I don't know where one and two is. I think we couldn't find it. We could find number three, four. I have five. I have six. Uh, let's actually see if I can open up seven. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm gonna show you where the gift box seven is. Uh, it's quite hidden a little bit. It's by the gummy bee, which is right over here. Let's go in here, and we have to jump all the way down. We need a parachute to do so. Let's see if I can open it. I don't even know if I can. Can I? No, still no. Um, it, it's just a little weird sometimes. I don't know. I We haven't figured out the presents yet. <laughs> Not much, at least. But yeah, you have to open up four of those to finish that. And then you're quite done with By Golly Get Jolly. Now to the end. Let's actually check out on um, what we're going to get uh, once we finish it. So, it's going to be right here. Talk to Bee Bear. Holy, have a holly jolly bee smith. Uh, it's the best time of the year when the honey blah 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 blah. There's a lot of stuff he's saying. And if you already have a cup, buddy, I want to know what your Star Treat's favorite song will be. <laughs> uh, complete one more uh, quest and I'll give you three super smoothies and a festive planter. That's something I really want. And six more quests for your cup, buddy. I want that too. Oh, look at that. Gives me a lot of stuff. Glue, Willwig, Smooth Dice, Tropical Drink, five micro converters, and two gingerbread beers. Very, very nice. And um, yeah, let's go on to the next one. And I'm going to make a video on how to absolve and make that happen here. So let me see. Oh, all right. Yeah, I'm going to check that out in a second. And then uh, I'll see you in another video. Goodbye. Peace out. And uh, take care.